Okay, now we can uh, talk about the material, but material with uh, a few advanced material, because uh, now we see uh, in the previous video, we see all, only the principles shader and how it's working is uh, very simple to work, but also there is some, uh, here you can see also there is uh, some texture. You can use texture, for example, if you want, and there is uh, a few difference. Uh, uh, and um, also we see the difference with uh, the, prin the principal shader core here. And also I want to talk about how to mix uh, the material together and how to use, for example, the different kind of material for use, for example, the displays and also for use the uh, continent, the little, uh, is called the material builder for use that. And the first uh, things I want to talk about now, also here, where is the principal shader core and I can assign. The difference with the texture I have here and here I don't have texture because I can assign the texture with the another VOP here. This is a called Vex Builder and this, uh, this contest is the material contest. It's a few difference because the, the previous, uh, because uh, in the previous version of uh, Houdini we have the shop material the shop material, in this case I have the constant and now I talk also about the constant very fast. Uh, we build the, the material inside that contest. And usually when you work with this contest, you don't, you have also the, the you can build the material, but it's a, it's a few difference and is a few complicated sometimes. sometimes. In all the Shin, all tutorial, maybe you see that this is a very difference from the material. Uh, why side effects decided to split in the shop contest, the shader shop contest with the material contest? Personally, I don't know, but uh, I think it's because you can uh, here you can find a more fast way for use that, and here is a very different. Here you can use that, for example, for creating the material ID. You can also create the constant. And the constant here is the color you can apply to your geometry, for example, for creating the mask when you're compositing that. We see that in uh, maybe in the with the example in the future, because now I don't want to lose more time for talk about this. And but usually in the with uh, I remember with uh, 14 or 15, uh, would you need 15 or 14? Uh, this contest shop contest is uh, abandoned, and so we can use the material contest, it's very fast to use that. However, here you can work like a VOP. Obviously, you, uh, we don't talk more about VOP in, in the previous lesson, but here you can work with the VOP. You can also create the system and connect it for create, for example, a different mask, etc., etc. We come back a few uh, on the subject of the um, here on texture. Here the texture, you can apply texture, for example, here you can choose the texture and for example, we can go to take the texture here. Um, for example, also I show image and I can take, for example, our butterfly. For example, I don't show the, the sequence. So this butterfly, for example, and uh, but sorry, because that is the ground, I can copy that, okay? And I can call big hair. Obviously, here we have the coordinate, we have the UV system. Oops, okay, and drag and drop, okay? And uh, with uh, the UV system, obviously you see the how is mapping. If you don't have the UV system, you don't see how is mapping, but uh, also in the last version of Houdini it's changed a lot the UV so for that I don't want to talk about more and not talk about now about the UV because uh, 
it's a few different so I want to test again and so on uh, and usually the VFX art is not working with OV usually however here you can see also just in uh, our viewport we have the texture is Apply it's Apply the texture if I come to the render view and choose mantra and choose my camera and render you see here we have the texture it's aptly with my, my on my geometry okay also here you can come here and you can expand it, your texture voice and you find for example the texture use texture base color texture intensity and cetera, and cetera. Also, how this work is a decal streak or is automatic linear space. The linear space is the gamma system, and with automatic, usually it's uh, it's work. However, I have another way for apply the texture. In fact, if I click here, we have the color map, for example, and also we have the texture. Okay, the texture here. Texture and color map is similar, but we have some uh, difference uh, here, some different option we can use it. And here we have only the color map. Also, we see here the mandrilla, it's aptly by default. Also, I think also here, yes, yeah, also here we have the mandrilla texture is aptly. And I can connect it now with uh, the principal shader for example i have this texture this texture is uh, remember is mandrill or that we can try with that without problem and i can connect this on my base color obviously in this case we are we have the error but we see maybe we don't see now we don't see now the, the texture because the texture it's, uh, if I can delete this and delete also that. We have the gray material, okay. I want to change the color to this brown material, this the okra, okra. And I want to connect this here. Or I prefer connect the, the text or maybe the text is taken without problem. Okay. We don't see the text now. Okay. Why? Because here we have um, some problem when we can apply the text or here. Okay. Also, we need to use the text or if you use the text or now maybe you see. And this use texture also you can control with the constant value. Constant value, this is very similar to VO. You can connect it here, use texture here, and that you can connect it here. And here you can say zero is equals to not use texture, and one is equal to use texture, okay? But we don't see here. Here the difference uh, uh, if you complicated, uh, but uh, sometimes when you work with principal shader, you remember you have the text texture here. Uh, you can assign the texture by default from this uh, this tab. Difference is uh, with the our principal shader core. I can big core, and I can assign and I can change the color uh, with this um, kind of red. And you see here, you have that color assigned. Also, the principal shader core sometimes is very funny to use because uh, we don't have, for example, the here, you can see in surface use point color, you need uh, every time to uncheck. Here, you don't have, here it is more essential uh, essentially shader you can use it and also I can try to assign for example the base color to the color I can assign my mandrill texture and now I see my mandrill texture is aptly okay this is very good this is very fast also with the color map here 
if I assign, for example, we can change with uh, the, for example, another kind of texture and assign also in the base color, the color map, I see it's assigned also my color map texture, okay? So where is the difference between that? It's uh, sometimes here you have a lot of uh, information, a lot of, uh, for example, option you can assign here and here you is very essential. You can assign only the value here. I want, for example, uh, mix uh, this material here. You can find also you have the layer and for example, you want to mix the two texture or two material together. How I can do that? I can do that with the simple operator. It's called layer mix. And the layer mix here, we can also come here, here. And I can, for example, assign here that. Okay, it's not taken. Why is not taken? And why I can mix this? Because it's need also here the different color. Sometimes the color you can connect with a different color together. And here, and I need to connect the layer with the layer. Okay, so I have the layer A. I want to mix this with, for example another I can use for example principal shader also core it's okay assign for example red okay and I sign here that if I sign this layer mix here I see it's mixed it's mixed but how is uh, mixed that how is we with the alpha zero one, so it's take this and this and mix it with the 50%. And also, you can say use only the A or use the mix only the B or mix together this element. You can choose also that. And also, you can use the texture for mix it with uh, connect with, for example, the our alpha and for example I want to use the checker map for mix it and or for example the position I can use also the position we can see with the color the checker map I can create the checker the checked and this checked you can also assign a different color by default it's uh, you can connect it here uh, you see now he's working uh, usually it's a uh, black and white map and uh, also we can see with another shader also I can apply that here in the base color and I can apply one moment only the principal shader that and it's, the map is a black and white, so it's take the black and white, like the white is show uh, the white and uh, it's black is show the black. So it's, uh, it's change the color is that, we can disable that. And if I apply, for example, that, you see where is the white color, you have the red and the black color, you have the our pig air color apply. But also I can use that if you want. I can copy that, I can apply here. And from here I can choose all, only the B. So we see only the B now. The B is, is red, if I can connect the base color is the my checker. In my checker, I can also change the color with the color mix, for example. And uh, for use color mix, uh, I can use, for example, here, I apply here, color mix, and in color mix, here I can connect the primary color, secondary color, and bias. The primary color, if I connected, for example, this texture, but yeah, primary color, mix texture, 
and in secondary color I want for example the checker I can connect here and uh, I can connect to my base color we see what's happened where is my primary color it's uh, the texture and the secondary color is my checker is a white color okay and this is the one way for connected for example the texture I use the texture inside one of the checker but also I can disconnect that here and I can connect my amounts for example to bias and here if I do that I can control here the checker with my color here my primary color and here we have the pink and we here we have a violet and I can control with this two color here for example if I assign the green and my primary color I can assign the channel okay you see we have the channel and the green okay obviously I can I, yes I can use also that like the layer mask here but usually it's better way to use the grayscale map or the white and black maps because it's like 0 to 1 and in this case you don't have 0 to 1 you have a very particular situation and sometimes it's not working very well another things we can do is for example if you want to move the few your system here your checker for don't have the regular checker you can also you can change the dimension here for frequency you can put four and four for example you have uh, here big check or you can apply 16 and 16 you have more small heads okay but also you, i want for example apply the noise and the noise on the uv system if i apply for example uv noise I can connect this here. This is the noise, the classic noise we can have in uh, all system. And here you have the frequency, here we have the offset, the amplitude, we can work with that for create your noise. You can see here we have, yes, we have the checker, but it's uh, moved around, it's noise uh, effects, it's uh, apply on that. And so with that, I also I can now I can for example connect it with the primary my texture and now you see we have very very crazy effects and we can apply that for example for have a very nice effects here with very various effects with the noise etc. Also here now I can uh, uh, create the mix and if I mix that with use the, the checker we see it's very crazy because uh, we have the check it's a checker here and some is very noise etc etc